welcome back to another Roblox video, but today we're having a tutorial on making highway signs for your Roblox game um, with Inkscape. So first off, you have to go to the Ultimate Driving Universe forums, go to uduniverse.com slash forum slash show thread dot php question mark tid equals 89. I'll post the link in the description for all the websites that we will visit today to get the required materials for the signs. So, for starters, you have to download the Inkscape sign template. And for some reason, this link doesn't work for Dropbox. So, we're, I up, re-uploaded the template just for this video. And it is here at mediafire.com slash file slash 5499zkpbafi 5i85 slash inkscape sign template dot svg and uh, obviously you won't remember that so again i'll post the link in the description of the video um it is in it is a dot svg file scalable vec vector graphics image and that file can be opened with Inkscape. So you have to go to the Inkscape website to download Inkscape and and um, get it to use the software. You go download Windows here and then it, it should download and work. After you've downloaded it, you're probably going to want to download the template. So, again, go back to mediafire.com if you haven't already downloaded it, that is, and click the download button, and it should work. I already have it downloaded, so, yeah. After that's done, you might want the Road Geek fonts. So, there's this link here in the UD forms, uh, HTTPS github.com slash sam dot slash roadgeek dash fonts slash releases and so on and you can that link works so you can go here to this tab github.com and download this zip file and after you have that downloaded open the file folder and go to the zip downloads and here, go to the zip file, and we open it, and take all these fonts and drag them into the fonts folder under Windows, Windows, fonts, and drag them in there. This process may be different for a Mac computer. After you have that downloaded, um, if you want, you can get the traffic fonts. From dafont.com. And they have these traffic fonts here that are nice. I think they're the same as Road Geek, but not sure. They look the same. Anyways, you can also get those. Now that we have all those downloaded, we can go to Inkscape and open up the file. Okay. We have Inkscape open. You'll go to File, op Open, and get the Inkscape sign template here. And it should open. And I have created some signs here, so yeah. Um, and if you select the text box, you can see that it, the fonts are here. Road Geek 2014 Series EM and so on and so forth. Um, here for the tutorial, I will create a sign just for the tutorial to show you how it works, sort of. Press Ctrl D to duplicate and you can drag the sign down here. If you want, you can add an exit sign. and drag that down and put that on the corner there exit one two three we'll go with that 
and let's add an Arizona State Route sign. Put that right there. We'll fix that later because it's probably not in the right spot. Drag this down for state route number. Change that to the 87. That's the Series C, Road Geek Series C font. And we'll position that in there like that. There. And now we can drag that to the center. Turn off. You can turn off corner to corner or cuss node to corner mode by holding shift down, which makes it easier so you don't have a um, bunch of stuff all over stuck to a corner. And we'll just drag that in the middle there. That looks good. Now you can add text over here in the text box thing. Click text down there and you can type. Ta-da! It's as easy as that. And you can go down here, change the color. Boom. You have your sign. And you can customize it by dragging the other stuff down here like an exit only. Drag down an exit only. It does not fit, so we'll just fix that there. And that looks good. Sort of ish. Yeah, not really. Eh, whatever. It'll do. And we can fill that. Where's color picker? Um and this that you yeah, that's fine. Okay. Fills down there and that should do it. So here you have your nice sign which you can move a little and that's not centered. There. No, that just moved. That's fine. Yeah. I'll change the exit number to what it actually is. 13. So yeah, that's the Inkscape sign template. Uh, these signs here I made for my mini driving rating game, so you can check that out. I'll post the link in the description if you want. This sign here, that came with the template, and I made this two sign, because uh, there isn't one on Roblox. Yeah, and the signs up here above all the stuff here, um, it, these, are, these come with the template, and you can watch... UD's Ultimate Driving staff member, Zephy94, um, he made um, a video on YouTube that shows him speed building some signs, and he's the one that made this. So, this looks good. Yeah. Posting, um, remember, I'll post all the links that we used today in this video in the description. Um, yeah. And when you want to upload, make sure that you upload the exit sign at the top separately from the base sign. Because if you upload both of them, then there will be a little blank space here where there's nothing at. So it's better off that you upload them separately. Thank you all for watching. Um, I hope you enjoy and I hope this helps you make um, great signs for on Roblox for your driving games. Thank you all for watching. This is I.I. Nady. Remember to subscribe and like. Bye!